Hey everyone, good morning. I'm trying to be a little quiet because our roommate is still sleeping. Yes, update, we got a roommate. Um, I look crazy because the last couple days have been crazy and I just woke up. But today we are going to Logan's mom's graduation from college and I'm gonna try to vlog. Don't know how well that's gonna go because I'm still in that awkward thing where I don't like vlogging out in public to where people will stare at me, but I'll get some clips here and there. And then I'll vlog some stuff afterwards of maybe like cleaning up some things I got because I was gonna do a haul or like another Ipsy Boxy Charm type thing, but my October one is still needs to come out and it's still crazy late since it's December. So I'm probably just going to show some of the things I have got, but I'm going to go make coffee. I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so now I have to get ready and I already primed my eyelids and everything, but I'm going to use the Morphe and Jaclyn Hill. Which one is this? Uh, bling boss from the vault this is the only one I have from the vault or vault however you want to pronounce it so I'm going to test it out and see if it's actually as bad as everyone is saying it is So far, in my opinion, it blends better than the original Jaclyn and Morphe palette, in my opinion, but everyone's different. The shimmery shades, like this one I'm using this one right here, not that fantastic. Like it's pretty, but it doesn't have as much payoff as I would want it to, so I'm gonna have to layer it up. Something you do have to put into consideration with these types of purpley and red shadows, like the plums, they can stain, especially if they are a straight pigment shadow. I'm not sure if these ones are, but there is a chance of them staining. So I have this like little mini eyeshadow from Nomad in the shade Around the World. Just a little tiny little thing. It's a highlight, but I'm gonna use it in the corner of my eye. Okay, well I tested that out, and I'm gonna go do the rest of my makeup, and I will continue this vlog later on. So, I'm back home. I'm quiet again because everyone's out and about cooking and stuff, but I'm still a little weird about vlogging, but Sorry, I didn't really vlog or anything during the graduation. It kind of slipped my mind, but we're back. disgusting because I just showered and today I'm just going to be painting more and cleaning so there's no point in me putting makeup on but 
I do need to clean like my eyeshadow brushes and my bathroom and stuff and there's some stuff that I want to talk about so I figured I'd have like a cleaned up chit chat with me thing before I go and do my second painting. So my plan is is to have a makeup giveaway this week because I have so much unopened makeup that I'm not going to use but I figured because if it's just all in a box just sitting in my room and it's no one's using it so I might as well give it to someone else. And I think the way I'm going to do it is I'm going to post a picture of the giveaway items on Instagram and just do the basic tag someone or something like that or post it to your story. I haven't exactly decided yet but I will leave my Instagram down below if you want to enter because it will end Christmas Eve I think is what I'm going to do. But I have palettes, lipsticks, um, there's mascara, concealer, uh, eyebrow product, there's quite a few different things in there. There's like glitter shadow, shimmer shadow, pigment, stuff like that. So if that's something you're interested in, then go ahead and head to my Instagram and then just follow me and then do whatever the entry is like, post to your story or tag someone. Doing it pretty simple. I also am starting my own palette, or I'm starting to make my own palette. Um, right now I kind of have the trial one going on, but I can't order it right now. I'm still deciding on names and stuff like that. Right now, the palette that I'm working on is literally a trial palette, but I'm also going to be hand making my own. I kind of just want to go through this company that I'm trying right now and see how I like theirs. Of course, I'm going to try it out first before I recommend it to anyone because I know the quality eyeshadow that I would want to use and I wouldn't want to recommend anything different to anyone else. I'm also currently writing three books right now. Um, two of them are poetry books. Um, they're, typically they don't take this long to come out. I only have two, but typically they were like six months apart or something like that. But this one's gonna take a little bit longer because I do have an illustrator to illustrate the book with me. So that's really exciting and that's why it's gonna take longer. And I'm also writing one that's in a style of like Shel Silverstein or Silverstein. I don't remember how to say his name, but I love his work. And it's like the sing-song rhymey type things, kind of like Gabby Hanna's poetry book. And I'm also currently writing my first novel. And I've been saying that, and the thing could always change because I actually have a couple books started already, but I always like lose motivation to write them or I get stuck writing them or I get a new idea. So I'm like, I'm really bad with that. So we're not keeping our hopes up, but I'm hoping that this one will be the actual one that I publish. So we will see. I haven't posted what it's about or anything. I did post the name of it on my author Instagram and it's called House of Athena. Um, and then the picture of it is kind of like the concept cover. So it's not, it shouldn't be the actual cover, but it's kind of, literally exactly what it sounds like, a concept cover. Something else I'm extremely excited for is yesterday I started taking my online courses to get my MUA certification, so it's a makeup artist certification, and I'm really excited about it. So I had my first class yesterday, and hopefully I will get that soon, but that is the next step to wherever I want to take a career. And I also kind of want to talk about why I've been kind of MIA on my YouTube. Um, there's been a lot of personal things going on. Um, we've been pretty busy. Logan and I have been extremely busy lately with Christmas coming up and all of that. But mainly I've just been taking like a mental health break. That's why I keep, I would like post a video and I'd be like, I'm going to post more. And then I just don't because like another issue came up or I got upset again. So that's why I am trying really hard to start filming and uploading more, but there's only so much you can do when your mental health is all messed up. Just remember mental health always comes first. So that's kind of what I'm doing with it. Um, I will hopefully have this video up today or tomorrow. I'm probably just gonna upload it this evening 
that way it's out there because I haven't posted a video in like three, four weeks and that's not good. Even though like I don't, I only have like 50 followers, but I still care about all of them and I want them to be subscribed to someone giving content that they enjoy or at least giving content. And then I might try to pre-film some things. Sorry, my faucet's running. I might try to pre-film some things because I'm going out of town January 3rd through the 7th and going to Oregon. I'm going to try to vlog while I'm there, but we all know how that goes, with me at least. So I'm not making any promises with that, but I am going to try. I'm going to try to vlog Christmas Eve and Christmas. We'll see how that goes again, just because we have quite a few places to go and all of that. But that's pretty much the updates I have for now. I'm sure I'll get more some later, or I'll get more some later. I'm sure I will get more later and then I'll include another like little chit chat thing or another vlog or something like that. But for now, I will see you guys in a couple hours, which in reality to you guys, it'll be like a second or two. And it will be my second painting that I am going to do and I've just been procrastinating with it so long because the first one messed up and I'm really afraid that the second one's going to mess up because I only have two more canvases so I don't have room to mess up but we'll see how it goes. <music> Okay, so I finally got both of the Christmas paintings done, so now I have to wait for them to dry, put a clear coat over them, wrap them in all that, and I'm finally happy with how the pour turned out because that's the second time I've done it, and I like that one. So all of that is done now, now all the gifts just need to be wrapped. Um, so that's pretty much it for <laughs> this vlog. Um, it wasn't really eventful, it wasn't too much of vlogging, just doing tasks itself. But same thing, right? Not really, but, but I want to try to do more things like that more often. Maybe I can do those more since I'm not really filming actual not vlog videos that much, I guess. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Say bye, Todd!